Well, here's the Arizona offense we expected. Spread them out. Here comes Suggs. And there's Johnson in trouble. And there's the sack. Oh, they were trying to hold Suggs. And he just broke free of the hold. And Terrell Suggs leading the nation now with 21 sacks. Steve, and this guy is as good. He's down here in the corner. Watch him working against the tackle. They're going to flag the offensive tackle as well for a hole, but Terrell Suggs is as good as they get. Coming off the edge, and you know who he reminds me of, Steve? It's going to be scary here. Number 56 in blue. No way. NY Giants. None other than LT Lawrence Taylor. The That's... guy could take over games single-handedly. That's too much pressure, though, Rams. You not can't so... be saying stuff like that. No, it's not too much pressure. LT? Ture Terrell Suggs. Steve? How about Derek Rogers, who played How about at Derek Arizona Rogers? State? He's How good. about LT? Do you run at him, or do you run away from him? Now on extremely short field for Arizona. They ran for a touchdown in their last possession. They'll run it again, and fumbling the football is Bo Carr, and Arizona State has it. Mason Unk again. Unk with an interception. Unk with the fumble recovery. Steve, no excuses. John Makovic sitting there saying, you've got to be kidding me. We can't punch it in the end zone, and we end up fumbling the ball. Watch. If the exchange is clean, well, yeah, and guess who's there? Terrell Suggs, T-Sizzle, knocks the ball out. Terrell Suggs, Steve, you're going to keep hearing his name over and over again. Watch Suggs. Wow! Rip the ball out. Ball's on the ground. Mason Hunt there to recover. In rivalry oh, games, my in goodness. big games, that can happen. First and goal at well, the three, as the coach would say, get it done. Oh, and what's tough about this one, I mean, you know about Ohio State and Michigan, Oklahoma, Oklahoma State tomorrow, Auburn. SC UCLA, Alabama. SC Notre Dame now for a $27 million game. None of them might be as nasty as this one. I mean, you might remember last year when Arizona won at Arizona State. There's the second sack of the game by Terrell Suggs. This guy's a monster. This is guys like a T-Rex. He just devours quarterbacks. He likes to be called T-Sizzle, so we'll give him a watch this. He ends up coming once again and just beating his man off the edge, Steve. He, he takes a guy, Makoa Freitas, who's about 300-some-odd pounds, and Suggs is about 245, 250. Brent Guy, the defensive coordinator, talking to him before the game, he said, you know, Terrell Suggs put on about 15 extra pounds, Rams, <laughs> and I'd say they paid off. I, I Andre Thurman now goes in motion, and they will run the football to gain a Scott, and he will not gain anything. I'm talking about big-time throwers. Jason Johnson has thrown for 152 yards, and now comes out, fires to Bobby Wade, who fumbles the football. There is a flag down, and, and a scramble for it gives the football to ASU. Well, you no, know, the play's going to be called bad because Arizona State was offsides. Terrell Suggs, Steve, got a jump, and he was offsides at the top of the screen. They're going to call it back. Yep. Check it out. Watch where he lines up. I just saw I mean, I'm watching 48 the whole game. I got one eye on 48 the whole game. He's up here. Boom. He ends up leaving early. Jason Johnson takes a hit. Knows, though, that he drew Suggs off. So essentially, it's a free play, and that essentially the play just washes away. Suggs, though, is one of those guys. He gets a great jump on the ball. I'll say. He is so quick off the blocks. He had a game earlier this year where he had four and a half sacks in one game against Washington. Take a look. Take a look. See how, see when he moves now. A lot of, you know, he's off, though. The, the side judge had a real clear look at it. That's his lone responsibility. You make that call, and he, out comes the flag. Only you. Somebody moved, and it might have been that right tackle. Might have been the right tackle. Well, you, you know what? He had Suggs on him. Yeah. He was trying to get I, the early break. You, now we go first and 20. Jason Johnson. 
He will hand the football off to Mike Bell, and boy, did it close quickly. Suggs was there, Unk was there, and Unk was the sound coming out of Mike Bell when he was knocked down. All you have to say is Suggs was there, and, and Suggs is everywhere. When you flip on the film of this guy, Steve, he's everywhere. If, you, if you're game planning against, I'm telling you what, McAvitt looked at the film, he doesn't know whether to run at him or run away from him. Jason Johnson has thrown for 217 yards. Arizona State has not allowed a 300-yard passing game in the Pac-10 Conference this year. And this from a league that has seen 35 300-yard passing games. Take a look at the Intel game summary. Locked up at 20. Bobby Wade sets a UA season record for catches. We knew that. Terrell Suggs sets the ASU career record for sacks. We knew that. Mike Williams, 110 rush yards. We didn't know that was coming because they're only averaging 2.6 on the ground coming in combined. Six turnovers, and that's been costly. Most costly mistake has been Sean Keel's missed extra point for the Wildcats. Well, the Cats lead by one. Reverse Bobby Wade.